Greensboro police tell me they received a $2 million grant, which they'll use to tackle what causes violent crimes in the Greensboro community. The grant is being provided from the DOJ's Community-Based Violence Interruption and Prevention Initiative. At a press conference held at police headquarters in Greensboro Friday, police were joined by members of the Greensboro City government, including the newly formed Office of Community Safety. Regina Glasby said police and their outreach partners want to make a difference and use a new strategy to reduce crime. So if you're really going to deal with crime, you've got to deal with housing. You've got to deal with economic mobility and lack of employment. You've got to deal with low-performing schools with education, um, health care. There are so many issues that drive crime. Police say they've already begun knocking on doors and holding community meetings. Letitia McNeil, the Office of Community Safety's manager, says this approach helps build a relationship between officers and the communities they're impacting. How we're working together in our public safety entities to create the change that we want in our communities because it's not in us versus them, it's in us, period. And interim police chief Teresa Biffle said police in the communities they're speaking with share a common goal in reducing crime and she's confident other cities will follow Greensboro's example. You're gonna look up Greensboro in the coming years and see what we're doing and what we're doing great here. Greensboro police say the funds will be used over a three-year period. In downtown Greensboro, Joshua Davis, WXII 12 News.